Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to explore a question that has intrigued scientists, engineers, and even curious kids with shovels. How far can we dig into the Earth? This question might seem simple, but as we'll find out, it's anything but. So sit back, relax, and let's dig into this topic, quite literally. First, let's talk about the Earth itself. Our planet is not a solid, uniform ball. It's made up of different layers. The outermost layer is the Earth's crust, followed by the mantle, the outer core, and finally the inner core. Each layer has its own set of properties, like temperature, density, and composition, which make digging deeper and deeper a growing challenge. The Earth's crust is where all of our digging and drilling activities take place. It varies in thickness, ranging from about 5 to 70 kilometers. When we talk about digging into the Earth, we are usually referring to penetrating this outer layer. But even within the crust, the conditions can change dramatically. The upper part consists mostly of solid rock, while deeper sections can contain semi-fluid material that makes digging quite complicated. Now, you might be wondering, what's the deepest hole we've ever dug? The answer is the Kola Superdeep Borehole in Russia. This ambitious project started in 1970 and reached a depth of 12,262 meters, or about 12.2 kilometers. That's deeper than the height of Mount Everest if it were flipped upside down. However, even this impressive feat only scratches the surface, as it's just a fraction of the Earth's total radius, which is about 6,371 kilometers. So why did the Kola Superdeep Borehole Project stop at 12.2 kilometers? Well, there were several reasons, but one of the main challenges was temperature. As you go deeper into the Earth, the temperature increases. At the bottom of the borehole, the temperature reached an astounding 180 degrees Celsius. That's hot enough to cook an egg, and certainly too hot for the drilling equipment to function properly. Another challenge is pressure. The deeper you go, the greater the pressure exerted by the layers of Earth above. This extreme pressure can cause the walls of the hole to collapse, making it difficult to maintain the structural integrity of the borehole. So, we've established that digging deep into the earth is a monumental challenge, fraught with obstacles like increasing temperature and pressure. But what about using advanced technology? Could we, in theory, dig deeper? In recent years, advancements in drilling technology have indeed opened up new possibilities. For example, diamond-tipped drill bits can cut through rock more efficiently, and improved materials can withstand higher temperatures and pressures. However, even with these advancements, we're still far from reaching the mantle, the layer, right beneath the Earth's crust. The mantle is a fascinating place, composed mostly of solid rock, but behaving more like a very, very slow-moving liquid over geological time scales. It extends from about 35 kilometers below the surface to a depth of about 2,900 kilometers. The temperature here can range from 500 to 900 degrees Celsius, and the pressure can be up to 1.4 million times greater than the atmospheric pressure at sea level. These extreme conditions would make any drilling or digging operation incredibly difficult, if not impossible, with current technology. Now, Let's entertain a hypothetical scenario. What if we could dig all the way down to the Earth's core? The core is divided into two parts, the outer core, which is liquid, and the inner core, which is solid. The outer core starts at a depth of about 2,900 kilometers and goes down to about 5,150 kilometers. The temperature here is estimated to be between 4,000 and 6,000 degrees Celsius. That's hotter than the surface of the sun. The inner core extends from 5,150 kilometers down to the Earth's center at about 6,171 kilometers. The pressure here is unimaginable, reaching up to 3.6 million times the atmospheric pressure at sea level. If we somehow manage to dig this deep, we'd encounter a host of new challenges. For instance, how would we even see what we're doing? At such depths, it would be pitch black and any light source would have to withstand extreme conditions. And let's not forget about gravity. As we get closer to the Earth's center, 
the gravitational force would actually decrease, making it increasingly difficult to keep drilling equipment anchored. But let's step back from these hypotheticals and focus on what is currently achievable. Various scientific missions are in the planning stages to dig deeper than ever before, but these are aimed at reaching depths of maybe 20 or 30 kilometers into the Earth's crust. Even that would be a monumental achievement, providing invaluable data about our planet's composition and history. So to answer the question, how far can we dig into the Earth? With current technology, we're limited to the upper portions of the Earth's crust, but who knows what the future holds? As technology advances, we might find innovative ways to dig deeper, unlocking the secrets that lie beneath our feet. In conclusion, the quest to dig deep into the Earth is not just a matter of curiosity. It has practical implications as well. For instance, understanding the Earth's layers can help us better predict natural disasters like earthquakes and volcanic eruptions. It can also provide insights into the availability of natural resources, such as minerals and fossil fuels, which are crucial for various industries. However, it's essential to consider the ethical and environmental implications of such endeavors. Digging deep into the earth can disrupt local ecosystems and may have unforeseen consequences. For example, drilling activities can sometimes lead to the release of harmful gases trapped beneath the earth's surface. Therefore, any such projects must be undertaken with the utmost care and consideration for the planet and its inhabitants. As we look to the future, the dream of digging deeper into the earth remains a tantalizing challenge. It's a task that tests the limits of human ingenuity and technological innovation. While we may never reach the earth's core, the journey towards that goal will undoubtedly yield valuable knowledge and perhaps even revolutionize our understanding of the world beneath us. So the next time you find yourself digging a hole in your backyard or at the beach, take a moment to ponder the incredible complexity and mystery that lies beneath your feet. And remember, every shovel of dirt brings us one step closer to unraveling the secrets of our planet. Thank you for joining us on this deep dive into how far we can dig into the earth. If you found this topic as fascinating as we did, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more intriguing explorations into the world around us. Until next time, keep digging for knowledge.